Rihanna is pregnant. Congratulations, ASAP Rocky. That video of you hitting that, was it a police person or a person who was following you? That video is going to be wiped off the internet. You're going to have Kardashian powers, like how they got that original picture of Chloe removed. You're going to have that power, ASAP. Now, we're not going to play like Rihanna didn't settle for ASAP. She, she did. And possibly because there, there is that Barbados link between the two of them, it, was, it made the conversation easier, right? Um, personally, I would have liked him, her to marry, to have a kid, to, to get married first, then have a kid. The same way Beyonce did it, right? But I, I think um, they both, you know, the time, because the, 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 the time for us women, it ticks, ticks. And I don't think Rihanna is going to be the type to save her egg for eggs and all of that. She's, she's that kind of person, you know? Now, what I want to see is the expression of Drake's face. What does Drake look like right now? Because when you listen to his LeBron video where he tried to justify his actions of, about hiding the baby or hiding the baby from the world, he mentions like, oh, she's not, he's not going to marry Rihanna and all of that. Cool. But more so, I celebrate Rihanna's pregnancy because of the work the Kardashians have done. Before the Kardashians, having a baby outside of marriage was seen as something that was you know, not to be celebrated. Even the baby showers you know, weren't that big. That's the term teen pregnancy was also associated with black women and poor white people and poor black women. But thanks to the Kardashians, that is now a, a renowned term. It has shown that teen pregnancy is not a certain tax bracket. You know, if a, uh, I don't think she was a billionaire then, Kylie, when she had a teenage baby. But it's just ironic because a few years before Kim, mocked the kids on, on, who were on the teen moms and said they were a bad example. They were that. No, they weren't a bad example. They were just poor because when Kylie got pregnant, you, you know, but let me not go there. The Kardashians have also given the term trapping a man because it's usually the black women who are associated with, oh, she got pregnant so she, she can live on child support. Yes, and, and two very black men who hate, absolutely hate black women. Those black, um, those black men are Jay, Jay the Black and Shea Duke Jackson. Every day they sell something about black women. I'm almost certain that they are the cream sleeper, or, or I mean they are like the cream sleeper, or Bad Henry. If you don't know the story of Bad Henry, it's these two is two murderers, serial murderers, uh, serial killers, who killed just black women. Their target was black women. So check it out. The, uh, the one is um, Bad Henry, and the other one is the Cream Sleeper. O'Shea Duke Jackson and Jada Black hate black women. But thanks to the Kardashians, the things of trapping, uh, having a baby to get wifed up, having double babies, uh, you know, all of that. But what, you know, thanks to the Kardashian, that's no longer, everybody celebrates, you know, even the fathers who would have thought would have been like, they are there in the baby showers now. Now, what, what, what I would like to, to say to S.A. Rap, uh, Rap, what, S.A. Rocky, that you are the luckiest, in fact, you are the first man S.A. Rep is, S.A. Rocky is the first man to ever secure the bag. It hasn't been done in the history of human beings. It hasn't been done because K. Federline did it, but we cannot be certain of um, Britney Spears' uh, mental state. And the thing is, Britney didn't have Rihanna money. But S.A. Rocky, you will go down in history. You secured the bag 
And I just hope that you are true to her because, <laughs> yeah, I, I, I don't know. You look at the way Chris Brown's career went after he hung Rihanna. <sighs>